With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. In this question it is saying, figure shown all the surfaces are smooth. All the blocks A, B and C are movable. X axis is horizontal and Y axis is vertical. Just after the system is released from the position as shown, the acceleration of A is relative to the ground is in the negative Y direction. Acceleration of A relative to B is in the positive X direction. Horizontal acceleration of B is relative to the ground is in negative X direction. And acceleration of B relative to the ground directed around the inclined surface of C is greater than G sin theta. Alright, so let us consider these cases one by one. So first of all, just a second. So first of all, let us draw the inclined plane. So let this is the inclined plane and these are the two blocks. Just a second. So this is block B and above it is block A. So block B and block A. So we see that block A has got no horizontal force, right? The horizontal force is absent because the component of G also is not present in the horizontal direction. Because this is a G component and this is G cos theta and this is along the inclined plane g sin theta similarly in case of b all right so since there is no horizontal component present the acceleration of the block a relative to ground is in negative y direction or downward all right so only acceleration component we can write a a as a x plus a a y there is also an a here so since a a x is not is equal to zero, so a a is equal to a a y, which is nothing but g. All right. So this is in the horizontal. Since it is downward, it is in the horizontal. Sorry, vertical negative y direction. All right. So this statement is correct. Acceleration of a relative to b is in the positive x direction. All right. So in the second statement. Acceleration of A relative to B is in the positive x direction. This statement is also correct because we know that B moves in the negative x direction, right? B moves in the x negative x direction to counter it. The acceleration of A relative to B must be in positive x direction. This is what acceleration of A relative to B. All right. So this is also correct. In the third statement, it is saying horizontal acceleration of B relative to the ground is in the negative direction, x direction. So this is also correct because A A B equal to A A minus A B. If this is in the positive x direction, then to counter this, this must be in the negative x direction. So this statement is also correct. And in the last statement, acceleration of B relative to this, to the reference directed along the inclined plane of C. So this is inclined plane C is greater than G sin theta. So this statement is also correct because we know that this is the component of acceleration of B, AB equal to G sin is greater than G sin theta, right? Otherwise the block won't move. Since the block is moving, so it is greater than or equal to G sin theta. All right. So this statement is also correct. So so here we considered the angle of the inclined plane to be theta. All right. So we see that option A, B, C and D are correct. All right. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.